Hello, everybody, and this is Zolerla and Exiluvia. Hi. And we are continuing King's Quest II. I last left off on this map that has a, or screen that has a uh, cliff on it, and wasn't totally sure where of all the places I've been to I need to go. So, here we go. And... It has been a little bit since we recorded the last one. Uh, not too long, though. Not too long, though. So this is the shop that's closed up. Yes. Do you remember the hint that the door gave you? What door? Is there something on the door? Not this door. The door that was on the other side of the uh, bridge. The door that... You mean the hovering door? Yeah, the hovering door. What, what did it say? I cannot enter it, of course. There's no breaking and entering in this, is there? Mm, no, no. Um, yeah, remember the hovering door had a clue on it. Um, okay, you know what? I don't remember what it said, because it was probably something that wasn't very helpful. Is that it's... the case? No, you already checked it last time. I probably did check it last time. Okay, so I think the door's on the other side of this ravine. Yes. And yes, that's pretty much the only hint of what you will be getting, or what you need to do. Does it say something like, pray with a priest? Whoa, almost fell off there. No. I'm just waiting for that to catch you at one point. Got me a couple times. With that crack? Yeah. Hey. Hey. You gave me a point again. Yep. What's the point of that? Is there like a certain number of times you cross it and you get a point? Well, kind of. Will undoubtedly make a splash. Yep. So, it sounds like you could have fallen in some water. Mm, yeah, pretty much. That's gonna be fun. <laughs> well, I already know that the lake's poison. Don't gonna go that you. way, because that's death. Yeah. You know the lake's poison isn't just gonna kill you. Well, yes, I already tried that. Yes. Yes, you did. Okay, seriously? It's, it's giving me another point. Does it give you a point in each direction? Oh, it does. Why are you laughing? What do you mean, why am I laughing? Because I could hear you laughing over there. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Did I take too many points? Yep. That is actually one of the dead man walkings in this game. Oh, is... shut up. You are only allowed to cross that bridge a certain amount of times, and then it will not allow you to cross anymore. Oh. Well, isn't that fun? And guess what? The I'm number... not dead man walking right now. No, no, no. The number of times Whoa. you need... <laughs> it really wants to kill you. The number of times that you need to cross is the exact number of times you are allowed to cross. So if you cross too many extra times, you will be dead man walking for the rest of the game. Oh. So if you had read that inscription one extra time, you would be dead man walking for the rest of the game. This is fast. I dread to see what... Uh, I'm going to regret this, aren't I? Regret moving with any sort of speed. Oh, possibly. <clears throat> well, there are a lot of wet Spooky places forest. to go to. Making a face. Are the shadows always this long? Yeah, they've always been that long. Now they're gone. Yep. There are no shadows at all. Nope. No shadows on the beach. Oh yes, and each time you read the inscription, apparently it sets a magical flag that will let you know that, hey, you can actually get the key now. So you actually do have to go there and read <clears> it. <throat> each and every time. Oh, 
Well, there's a splash going. Uh, not now. There's a time when you can dive. I just suddenly look, forget how to swim. Mm -hmm. I'm already swimming. Yep. I'm floundering, but I'm swimming. Okay. So sure. you're not allowed to go out that far. Sure. Sure. That's that, an invisible that, barrier. That gives us a lot of screens out there in the water that you have to search through if you actually have to go out there. That's true, so maybe you should look for something else first. Uh, something else with water. That is not it. Well, thanks for the obvious hint there. <clears throat> Wait a minute, there's a coconut. The one and only tree that has a coconut. And the game doesn't recognize it. Well, okay then. Well, no, it's not a coconut. Coconuts aren't yellow. Neither are people. But look at what Graham's color is, it, color is here. I don't believe he's a people. He's really tiny. He's really tiny and not a people? What is he then? I don't know. Maybe an elf. Okay. Maybe that's why the dwarves are out to get him? Yeah, that could be. So he turns into a human later games, so I don't know. King Graham, the transformative years. Go back up. Why? why? Not, I didn't say left, I said up. Okay. Are you going to get me killed? No. Are you going to point out how this rock is bordered in black and this one's bordered in gray? Or no. that I can walk on the water? Oh, I was walking on that water. Remember that um, Red Riding Hood puzzle? Yeah, where she just randomly shows up. Uh-huh. What about it? Oh, uh, I probably should... Look at my inventory, because that's what you're hinting at, isn't it? Trident, bracelet, earrings, chicken soup, clamshell, bouquet of flowers, steak, brooch, and a cross. Brooch. Brooch, right, not brooch. Brooch. Okay. Okay. Do you want me to tell you what I was hinting at? Sure. Really? You know the puzzle that you had to find Red Riding Hood? Yeah, how it was completely random. Uh-huh. How'd you get her to trigger? Walking around. More what? specific. I Going and... I don't know how I got her to trigger. She just appeared on one place. Yeah, she, she appeared she right on here. one map. I think After it was this you map? left. It was just crawl along along. Yep. Are you saying that she only appears on that one screen? And there's something that appears on this screen? Oh no, Red Riding Hood appears in I think two screens. So there's specific screens, so I need to go off and on of every single screen until something spawns. Well this one has one specific screen. Oh, oh goody. You need to go back up. So it is that screen? Yes. So the screen has a completely random encounter that shows up on it, and there's no way to proceed in the game if it doesn't happen. Yes. How the shit are you supposed to know that? I have no idea. This screen? Yes. I've been on this screen many times. Yep. You didn't, ha you didn't read the door at that point, though. It, 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 I've been on this screen many times... Since we started doing this recording. Yeah, and? Oh, watch the excitement of leaving and coming. <sighs> you, I think you have everything you need to get the stupid thing to trigger. Somehow I maybe, was... You, maybe go back out through the water and come back in through the waterway. It's oh. this screen. Okay. 
No, I mean go left. Wait, there's a time I can down. get this down? And then down. Why are you going too far? Because I can? Because we could see this exciting water scene. Hey, fish. Nope, okay. You have everything. I don't know why... Uh, did she do the... Th this is going to be real exciting video coverage here. Walk on the screen, walk off the screen. Walk on the screen, walk off the screen. It triggers here. I know it triggers here. I... And you read the door... How about I just loop the whole thing around just in case? You can, yeah. You have the thing and the thing. It's going to be slightly more exciting. Oh, there's another coconut bush. This is going to be slightly more exciting than me just going on and off the same screen over and over again. Do you have to Not do another much. flag? That would be annoying. How would I know? I've never played this game. Uh, this is back where we started. Yeah. Back with the single lonely coconut. I mean, it's not like there's anything else you can pick. Well, there is a couple items you can pick up. Which is why I'm thinking there might be a flag. So we will come to the random... You didn't read... What? Uh, I don't, can't remember if you actually read the door. I think you did. Yes, I did. Yeah. Okay, so go... Um, okay, so look at your inventory again. Okay. So you don't have much. And there's only a couple NPCs that you can talk to right now. Actually, there's only one NPC you can talk to right now. No, so there's, there's three, at least. Three? You talk to the priest. He doesn't say much. Oh, yeah. Well, and you could talk to Red Riding Hood's mom or grandma. Grandmother. You technically, you are completely done with the priest. He does not matter for the rest of the game. So they have a two screen thing on the map for just getting a cross. Yes. Okay. So who's the, oh, the third one's the witch? Yeah, third one's the witch. I mean, you, you really know, talk to she her. just, she just, do, just kind of kills you. You did that last time. I, I know I did that last time. I'm still in awe of the fact that he's going, yuck, it's a skull. Why would I touch this? It's like... Anyway, so you might want to go to talk to Red Riding Hood's grandmother. Because that did all sorts of good last time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and remember last time it's like, oh, it's the grandmother not actually a wolf? Oops. Yeah, it's randomly a wolf. It's random? Yep, it is completely random. Oh, okay. So you wanted me to go there so I would die? Well, no. You're just thinking, ah, ha, ha. That's, that's a bonus, but... That's a bonus. We've got another death counter for Mark. Yeah, another death counter for Mark. Oh, I'm in the corruption. But seriously, it, is, it was also useful to show that because it is kind of a BS thing. There's a lot kind of like... Kind of is, yeah. yeah. Randomly, it's a wolf. Randomly, it's not. There's no way to pr tell or prove that one of them will be the one you want, which is the grandmother. Just, just makes me think of that... Uh-oh. What? The... That didn't even give me any chance to nope. react. Or... Why does it even bother showing the scene? Because it likes being an ass. Just out of nowhere, snatches me from behind a tree. So to go to grandmother's house. I was going to say, uh, Red Riding Hood's grandma's a little bit on the messed up side. You know, it's like, I'm a granny. I'm a wolf. I'm a granny now. Huh. Oh, I'm stuck. Yep, they punished you for playing at the fastest speed because stuff like that could happen. Even if I wasn't, I wouldn't have been able to escape. She was right next to me. You can You can immediately turn south and leave. Uh, at Granny's. No, this isn't a guilt game. What? 
Turn to south, south. Go, go, go. There you go. See? It's possible. Well, no, I was talking about the witch. Oh. Do I just sit and go in and out like this? Yes, you have to sit and go in and out until it's trying to again. There's no uh, other way to do this. There we go. But, okay, Granny, where the crap did the wolf go? Or did you seriously transform? They never mentioned that. It's just like, where'd the wolf go? It's just like, it's a ghost. What? It's a ghost. No, seriously. She's not a ghost. It's just. Why? Game? <laughs> I want to choke you right now. <laughs> she's sick and oh, she's old and sick. So do you give sick people? Um, a trident? Are Are you being serious? <laughs> Did you actually forget what you had in your inventory? Yes. Oh, you give her a steak. Okay. You are like the worst advertisement ever. Worst advertisement? We have lost our sponsorship to Campbell's. You don't give Campbell soup to somebody who's old and feeble. That doesn't help them not be old and feeble. That's it sick. What does she say again? She's ailing. Uh, of course. <coughs> Why would I think old was the problem? Silly me. I don't know. Why would you think old was the problem? It's a gigantic thing of soup and she just guzzled the whole thing down. Okay. Uh, no, Look no, under no. the bed. What? I have something for you. Look under the bed. What do you keep under your bed, grandmother? Okay. That doesn't look like a vampire cloak at all. Nope. I that, have no idea what you're talking about. You know, with a cross and a stake and a cloak. Yeah. I've got a great combination going there. Wait, wait. Why does Grandma have this? Why? Why do you have this? <laughs> I have a vampire lover. Well, she might be, um, you know, being bitten by the vampire. And that's why she's ailing. Okay. You also get a ring. Fair cloak. You lie, game! It's an invisible cloak for everybody but certain people. Or unless you look in a mirror? Maybe. <laughs> okay. Okay. Again, why do you have Count Dracula's cape and ring? Grandma. Well, if he was biting her and stuff, he might have left it under her bed for... Okay, reason. everybody. Giant cauldron of soup is now the cure for being bitten from a vampire. Yes. So you know, appar Sierra. Apparently there's a... <laughs> apparently there's a fan game of this that actually makes all these puzzles make sense. Okay. As in, they rewrote everything. Oh, there's still Red Riding Hood and Grandmother and Count Dracula and stuff in it. So they didn't write, write everything. All the NPCs are still there, but they just had it make sense for some... I don't know how they managed this. I haven't played it yet, and we we'll need to. Anyway, so that's pretty much all I can think of that you can... do. Do I just slowly turn into a vampire now that I have that? No. I, I am worried by that pause. I was like, that would certainly make for an interesting thing in the game, but no. Uh, oh, there's a thing you can do here if you want. I mean, in the, in the cave, which is cave. 
I'll go there later. Yeah. I have it in my mind to go to the witch's cave and mess with things. I just have not got that far yet. That's also an RNG puzzle. Or, I guess not an RNG puzzle. I just ran them if they're their puzzle. Suddenly, uh, the sun, it is getting burny. Excuse me. You have everything. Okay, come back. Go back. Keep going. I don't know what you need to do. This is where you need to go. I am getting thirsty for blood. Can you go off of the... We'll go back. You go off of the left side and then come back. Why from the water? I don't know. I'm just trying to think of how it did it. If it's a specific... Okay, go back out. Come back in. Keep doing that. Okay. Extreme swimming action. No it's, flopping around. I swear time. to God, it's here. And I think you have everything. I don't know. Ah. I did this. I did this game before. I didn't have a problem triggering this. It's all my fault. Yes. I don't know what you're doing, but you're doing it wrong. You had to walk into the room. It was the one thing you had to do, and you failed. <sighs> and now she's looking it up because look she's stumped. I shouldn't have to look this up because I played this stupid thing. Called romancing. Oh yeah, the thing is, uh, it's romancing the throne. Is the tag for this one? I don't know if he mentioned that. Yes, it did. And showed the really messed up face of the beautiful woman he's come to seek. Um. Okay. What's in your inventory? You have a necklace. Necklace? I have a brooch. Uh, you have earrings. Yes. You have a brooch. Okay, you missed the necklace. I can't imagine you getting the necklace as a freaking trigger. Trident, clam, bracelet, stake, necklace, goodies, um, give the goodies to any... the Red Riding Hood, right. get the soup, open the chest, take the earrings, give the soup to Grandma, look under the bed, okay. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? Give a mallet? Nope. Are you serious? Okay, um, so go back to grandmother's house. How the hell did I miss the mallet? I don't know, Lauren. How did you miss the mallet? I, I didn't see anything about a mallet. Okay, so go back to grandmother's house. Okay. This is so dumb. Okay, and now I'm gonna die. Uh... No, you can... If you didn't pause from walking, you could have ran out. But it did give you enough time. Anyway, so go to grandmother's house. This is dumb. I, I can't imagine this would trigger the thing, but I can't... That's... I'm done the right position. I could have swore no, I don't looked go through... into grandmother's house. I just said go to grandmother's house. Oh. Oh, right, yeah. I think, you know, when you go to somebody's house, you don't go into it. Okay, walk east, north, east, and north. Uh, okay. So here we do Lauren telling Mark what to do through a blind uh, a walkthrough. Uh, I don't remember the... No, I must have... Well, I've been on this map. Quick stuff. Go south. Go, 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 go. Okay, now go back up. Okay, now look in the hole in the tree. I've done that. Not in this tree, apparently. Apparently not. I've done that with so many holes in trees in this game. <laughs> and we missed one. Okay, 
Okay, so go back to the beach area that I told you to go to. Apparently you need a mallet. No, you don't need a mallet for that section, but I'm trying to figure out what the hell is causing it, the other thing to not trigger. Really? I'm in the water, can't get me. Okay, that's... Leave me alone. Well, here we are, traveling down the beach for the umpteenth time this video. Oh yeah, and I'm going to save first, because I don't know what's going on. Needs to have saving your game music. No, actually, no, it's internal speakers. No, it doesn't. I corrected myself! Hmm. So, is there a necklace that I need to get to trigger something? That's... it. You shouldn't need to get the necklace to trigger something. It's just extra points. It's this... It is this... It, ah! Yeah, can you look at that rock there? But yeah, it specifically mentions a large rock. Hit rock. Can't get the rock. Just go out and come back in. Okay, you mean like I've done plenty of times? Yes. Are hey. you sure that you read the door? Hey, game, cooperate. I didn't like, you know, not save before you did that. Well, not 100% sure. Uh, but you know, it'll be great if I go back to the door and have to restart the whole thing. Wait, you mean the whole recording? The whole game. I'm going to have to start the whole game all over again. Okay, well, there's one way we can prove this. Okay. Okay, so reload your Gantt 8. Okay, so, and go the bridge. And count how many times it takes to cross? Yes. Okay. That's the only way I can think of to do this. You know, besides just watching the whole video all over again. So, one, two, three... Four, five. Yep, okay, so you read it. Because you get seven tries. So, how about we stop here and then get the freaking thing to trigger so we can continue? Yes, that would be good. So, we will see you, and who knows how long this is going to take. Yep. Bye, everybody, for the moment. And we're back. And we're back after having to restart the game a couple of times thanks to things jumping out at the edge of the screen and having to save every two screens. That was really fun. Yep, you also missed us not being able to get rid of running on the trigger for yeah. several Back and times. forth and back and forth. So, now that we don't have to watch that, we're going to try this again, going back to the water. Make sure it actually works this time. Hey, look, it actually works this time. Oh, I also had him not missed. put on the cape, so it's like maybe if you look like Dracula, you, the the, the uh, mermaid doesn't want to talk to you. I guess. That's the only thing I can think of. You wore the cape, therefore the mermaid has no nothing to want to do with you. I'm going to regret this. Hmm? Hello, mermaid. Or not. Um.
Ooh, that's a hint, though. Um, Go look at your inventory. Oh, well, it wow. didn't Sexist. say anything. It's like, what? what? That... Mark, look at your inventory. Um, right. Because she wants flowers. That, but that <laughs> that shouldn't work. <laughs> it totally should work. She just jumped in the water and destroyed the flowers. Well, she was planning on eating them. I don't know. Uh, this looks safe. Yeah, totally. Hey, look, a shark. That's not a shark. That's a very tiny shark. It's That's called a, shark. a porpoise. That's a That's shark. That's a shark. The other one was a shark. No, it wasn't. Look at this one. Oh, and suddenly I'm in control. Yep. Uh, awful water music. Well, you have a headset on, so I can't hear it. Ha ha ha. Oh, it's Neptune. Oh, forgive me for using the wrong version of his name. <laughs> for, I, I read that as Mighty Underwear Empire. No. He's not controlling the underpants names. No. Uh, Just because you can breathe underwater doesn't mean you can talk underwater. Yay, a key! No, no. Key. 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 He doesn't want it. He has a lot. The Neptunes. I... That... But I... I want all the Neptunes. I want all of the Neptunes. You have to go through that little hole in the rock because you can't leave any other way. Yeah, and it seems to have a really weird movement as you're moving. This is suddenly just a uh, 2D side scroll. Shark! And I'm Another shark. Look. That is not a shark. Look, its, oh, its oh, tail is fine. flapping you're up right. and down. Fine, fine. Look like a shark. Sharktopus. What do you mean a sharktopus? What tentacles were on that dolphin? <laughs> Like a lot of them. You what did that dolphin it. do to you to make They're it invisible tentacles? That, I, but I. Okay, so save. I don't even know how to tell you save. how many ways you're wrong. What do you mean? There might have been invisible tentacles you didn't see. The, I... Anyways, moving right along. <laughs> Yay! You got the memory to trigger. At least. This is, I think, one of the last random nonsensey NPCs that you needed to trigger. Good, Most because having to these. get Riding Hood to trigger again was tedious. Yes. I'm pretty sure most of them will be there when you need them. As it were. Well, I knew that was going to happen eventually. Yeah. I knew that was going to happen. You, you knew that was going to happen. You called it. <sighs> And the sad thing is, even if you know it's there, you're still going to do it again. I, I knew it was there, and I was ready to deal with it, but I wasn't ready enough to deal nope, with it. Nope, that that chasm has killed me more often than anything else in this game, I swear. It's got a bit of work to do to catch up to the uh, wit, not the witch, the ladder for me. Yeah, that's true. Although the witch has killed me a few times. Oh, yeah, I hate that's... you, Bridge. Well, it doesn't like you either. I hate you too. You use water or use bucket to use it on the dragon. 
Yes. You use sling to shoot giant. You use key. The game doesn't know what you're talking about while you're standing in you front of a door. You want to unlock door. Yeah, you use key on the door. It doesn't work either. It's another door! <laughs> you don't understand hate. Oh. Uh, how are you a King's Quest game and you don't understand hate? It isn't hate the player. Uh, it looks like the player suffer. That's an even more useless hint than the last one. Does that mean I need to climb up a tree or something? No. No, there is no climbing of trees. There's technically no climbing of anything. Not even a mountain? Mm. You'll climb the mountain. Get away from that sound. Uh, so you want me to give you a hint of where to go next? Um, unless you want to watch me wandering around for who knows how long. Okay, do you have a guess of where you need to go next? No. Well, that's a different one at least. I'm gonna make you a green thing appeared there by the log. Huh. Are you dead? It said you're dead because you turned into a frog. Apparently, it's permanent. Hmm, okay. Anyways, because <clears throat> you have absolutely no clue where you want to go. Since nothing looked like it traveled up into the mountainside, no. Okay, where have you not been yet? I haven't been inside the locked house. I haven't been in the middle of the poison lake. Mm -hmm. And okay, there's one. Other, there's one place where you've been yes, to. I haven't been here. There's one place that you've been to, but you didn't do anything in. I've been to the witch's cave. There you go. That's not much of a hint. That's more like blatantly telling you what to do. How the hell does that have anything to do with setting your sets your setting your sights high? It's going into a cave. That's to go into the opposite. Yes, I know. Isn't it awesome? The uh No. Man. No, it's not. Okay. So this one you're gonna want to save. Really? Really I wanna save. Okay. Yes. Oh that's an appropriate name. Uh. And then you want to leave and come back in a few times. Are you freaking serious? <laughs> no, that doesn't solve the puzzle. But it's a really cool Easter egg. Okay. Well, don't don't. We're gonna call this the walking off and on to screens of an over north. edition. It, it makes it a little easier. There we go. I love your expression. That Wait, was that... not a really cool Easter egg. Oh, that was on. just I... freaking stupid. <laughs> it was really stupid. The um, I like '60s Batman though. Too, so when I saw that, I thought that was kind of nifty. In any case, Marcus just sitting here thinking, "God, she is such a dork." Hey, but look, there's a bat symbol above the cave. It's the bat cave. Uh, onward. You're going to ignore me now, aren't you? She's not in here. That's right. There is... Okay, look around the cave. Or leaf.
250. I was able to get the freaking cooking soup. You might want to leave. Huh. Okay. Um, was it not supposed to be that easy? No, technically, but whatever. Nightingale. Oh, was it a nightingale? Yes. Looking, looking at, you're going to... Oops. Are you trying to do this in third person now? Okay. Technically, you're supposed to get a cloth from inside the thing and put it over the cage. I didn't see cloth, though. I usually just use the cape. Um, whatever, whatever. Okay, there we... Maybe that's to take it while she's in there? Uh, maybe. That's true. I mean, once it's, if it's singing, she's not in there, it doesn't matter. So, it's just weird. I guess because you, you get extra points for putting the cape on it. Anyways. Now. Well, you don't need to anymore. So. Guess we take the Nightingale. Uh, I don't even know much about Nightingales. Doesn't matter. I mean, I recognize the name Nightingale, but I don't know. It's a little. Okay, where do you take the bird in the cage? Well, normally it's a canary with a bird in the cage taking into the. A it's cave it's thing. a pet bird. Where do you take the pet bird? <clears throat> oh, I know. We could take it to that place that somebody else took a dead parrot to. To the shop. That's a bizarre way of thinking about it, but actually you're correct. Because of course I'm correct. No, what was your actual thought of taking that? That was my actual thought on it. <clears throat> it's not a pet store, it's an antique store, though, you weirdo. You don't take a dead parrot to an antique store. Yes, you do. That's not even the... <clears throat> No. She at least look around the antique store a little bit. She doesn't want a dead parrot. You don't have a dead parrot. It's an ex-parrot. It's not an ex-parrot. Oh. Uh, what, I could get the lamp? Does it summon a dragon for me to fly and have to deal with really awful arcade sequence? No. You know, I never actually did that. Oh. I did not know there, there was entire texts talking about the freaking bird. Congratulations, you found a dialogue that actually makes the Nightingale make sense that I never got when I was growing up. <laughs> I also figured out where to go next on my own. Yeah. Because yeah, it isn't did. a random spawning thing. <laughs> now there's no reason to go into a cave. And it's closed again. Yep. It was open just long enough for you to give her the bird. For her. Yes. I'm glad you got the joke, Lauren. I'm glad you got it. Yeah, I got it. I got it. You think I got it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're going to do with the lamp. Drink it? No. This isn't... I was going to say this isn't Arabian Nights, but... um, <laughs> It's a lamp. <laughs> I know. I'm just saying... That's actually the wrong answer there. Um, I'm going to save before I rub the lamp. That's a good... You going to rub that lamp good? Oh, yeah. I'm going to rub it after giving her the bird. That sounds horrible. Wow, that's a little genie. Oh, okay. Bloop. 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 So, I'm assuming you could ride this to fly. Mm-hmm. Why do you ever need to use the bridge again? 
Because it's one-way carpet? It's a... It... That... <laughs> okay. So now I need to find the spot to use the carpet at? No. Just use it anywhere? Yep. Really? I think you have to be close to the mountain, but you are close to the mountain right now. Right, carpet. This looks safe. Yep. I would save again. Really now? <laughs> okay. That's lining up really well. I wonder if you can fall off. I'm pretty sure you can. There is a poisonous viper blocking my path. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, that's a viable way of catching a snake. Well, it is, but not for Sierra. I'm a hammer brother. I want no. to throw a mallet. No. You'll get through the mallet. The mallet has one use. That's it. That's how almost everything in this is. Yes, almost everything. There are things with multiple uses. Yeah. Really? Hey, it was worth a try. Do you need another hint? <sighs> what? I, where did I get a bottle? Oh, Neptune gave it to you. Oh. I guess you could look at the bottle. Oh, that, that's where the cloth is? What the hell? Okay. Just get cloth. Really? There you go. Okay, so that's how you get covered the nightingale's cage. Whatever. Really? Oops. Or you could just go in and the witch isn't in there. Yep. Really? Oops. You snake on snake. What do you want to do with it? Mark, what do you want to do with the sword? Okay, sum so, so that in, in two words. What do you want to do with the sword? Two words. <sighs> no. One of the words is snake. If you stabbed the snake with a sword, what would you be doing to it? Really? It's just kill? Really? Really? Eloquence! Hey, you don't know! I could put put it in the bottle! What else am I going to use the bottle for? The cloth that you never have to use again in the game. Damn it. Okay, anyways, dead snake. That was stupid. Oh, another hole. <clears throat> what? What? Really?
Yep. Really, you get to sit through an ad. Hey, Lauren, guess what game you're gonna be playing next? Um, is it gonna be Space Quest 1? Sure. Except the VGA one. Uh, so not this <clears throat> this version. No, I've actually never seen this version. Uh -huh. But I know what all the scenes are. They just don't look very good. Oh wait, I wasn't gonna play a lot of stuff of Darkness after this. Possibly. Yeah. Are, are we done yet? Okay. By the way, you're technically dead man walking. Was it from looking in the hole? No. Was it from using the lamp? No. What was it from, then? Well, technically using the lamp. Do you want me to tell you? Yeah. Yes. From killing the snake. This is the dumbest puzzle in the entire series. You want to reload before you kill the snake. Is this the thing where you said that the obvious answer isn't the answer? Yes. So reload. You know, I was trying to subdue the snake without killing it. <laughs> you wouldn't know how to do that. So why why does <laughs> why does this is the dumbest puzzle? Why no, does, no, that's that's after you kill the snake. Uh, why does killing the snake make you dead man walking? You'll see. You want to rub the lamp twice because you get three wishes. Well, I didn't know that this was where the third wish was supposed to be. Yeah! You never actually used the sword! And the, and the sword having a, a snake on its hilt is actually a false clue. Nope. Bridle. I thought it said girdle. Nope, it was bridle. Really? Get, get closer. I think you throw the bridle. And now you talk to the horse. <laughs> okay. What? Yes. Yes. This was the puzzle that was so dumb that... When they did a walkthrough and King Graham was talking about how he did this, the writer couldn't think of a way to make this puzzle make sense. So what he did was have Graham go for the sword, accidentally grab the bridle, and throw it on the snake. In the walkthrough that they gave to tell you how to do this. That was the, the only way they could think of why the fuck you would do that. So I think we're done for now. No, you need to talk to the horse. I... Okay. Really? Yes. You have to take the horse. <laughs> really? A magic sugar cube. Yes, and that magic sugar cube is actually really important. It's you don't technically need it, but it makes it so 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 much easier. And I didn't think you wanted to spend an hour on that puzzle without the sugar cube. Yes. Oh, Sierra. Oh, Sierra, don't you cry for me. So, we are done for now. Oh, I used 19 twice. Oh, well. Sugar cube. It didn't do a full, like, 3D animation of a cube and everything like Fez. Huh. No. So what did you think of that puzzle? That was retarded. <laughs> So, do you... Although, having to walk on a screen and have a, a the right flag there to make an NPC spawn on a map you've already been on that looked like there was nothing there mm -hmm. is freaking stupid. Yep. Anyways, I'm done with this for now. So, goodbye, everybody. Goodbye!